Here's a BSA A65 that's just arrived. And apparently this one is a thunderbolt with a lightning head. And the owner tells me that although it starts and runs, it uh, is reluctant to rev and splutters and pops and whatever. It's had new carburetors and it's had new electronic ignition apparently. So um, I just thought that I'd probably try and start it and see if it will start and run at all and just sort of perhaps get a feel for what I might need to do with it and this will be a reference point as to how things were when it came here and hopefully I can improve on it for him so I'm going to put the camera down now and um, we'll see if I can get it started I suppose and I've got an appropriate t-shirt on today by the way that's pure coincidence that it wasn't planned I knew the bike was coming today but I just grabbed the t-shirt and put it on and uh, what's on my t-shirt is very much like what we're looking at there anyway let's see what happens if I try and start it Checked. I've checked and um, there is actually fuel in the tank but I turned both taps on and there doesn't seem to be anything much coming through so there's my first clue I don't even know if there's enough coming through there to get this thing to start nothing moving there what about the other side Right. Got fuel coming down that pipe. Not at any great rate of knots, mind. But uh, there we are. We might uh, get it to start up. So it looks like we're already on the reserve tap, I would say. Is there a link pipe joining these two carburetors? Yes, we have. Just thought I'd have a look because uh, it's not always the case. Now look, for those that don't like me jabbing the tickler button, there I am holding it down. We've got fuel coming out the tickler of one carburetor, but there's nothing can't even hear the float rattling on this one. There could be a big clue there. Definitely get into that one. Hmm. Well, for the sake of it, I might as well give it a kick, but I think we could already be onto something there. Anyway, let's give it a go and see what we get.
first thing I'm going to look at is getting some fuel into this carburetor because oh hello hang on all of a sudden maybe the float was stuck so now it seems to be responding not a lot happening when I jab the tickler you can see activity in that fuel pipe if I just hold it down you can't really tell what's happening so I shall jab there we are we've got fuel at that carburetor let's just give it another try Still only going on one, so the first thing I've got to do is try and get this cylinder joining in. So uh, I'll have a little look at uh, what might be going on there or not, and uh, come back to it shortly. I've just taken the spark plug out of the non-running side, and it looked a bit oily. Funnily enough, the right side uh, spark plug on my own A65 is the one that seems to oil up and snuff out from time to time. Anyway. I've cleaned it up, tested it for a spark, and it is sparking, so I'm going to try again and see if I get it running on two when I try and start it. Let's see what happens now. Well, it sort of banged and popped a bit on the one, didn't it? And then um, cut out altogether. I'm going to look a little bit further into this. I won't bore everyone with uh, just kicking away at it and messing about. And uh, when I find something, which hopefully won't be too far away, we'll get back to it. 